Somebody once said that the new age of illiteracy won't be those who can't read and write, but those who can't unlearn and relearn the language of the youth. And that's what I attempt to reach out to. The youth, they respond to music and to the uh, fast going of the internet in a new age. So I believe it's important to identify with them. And you know, they don't care what you know, so they know that you care first. But my approach is always gonna be edutainment, education and entertainment. Brand name Williams. Presenting a great topic today on Social Capital. I really enjoy the fact that Brandon is very enthusiastic about what he talks about. Knowing that he is about the life that he's talking about. And it's not just he's pulling this out of nowhere. It's definitely something that he's lived. The event was inspirational because it taught me to utilize the uh, talents that I already have in order to be successful and fulfill my dreams and uh, go forth in my life after college. So it was really, it was really dope. Brandon Williams was a very inspirational speaker. He actually made me want to reach my goal to success and actually utilize my resources that I have here in college. Um, I would like to say thank you. Hello, my name is Kalia Liggins, and I just want to say I really enjoy um, Brandon's lecture today. I'm actually familiar with him. I have known him for several years as a student at SIU. Congratulations. Keep up the good work, and I hope to see you on the top. Thank you. Yeah, Will Smith said, uh, being realistic is the most commonly traveled road to mediocrity. And I, I said in one of my rhymes that, never mind you, I'm going to get it. Because you can chase your dream and end up working nine to five for somebody else who did it. Um, you got to chase your dream. And so me, I'm, I'm living out my dream through words and, and through speaking to people um, and showing them the importance of words and how they, they work and how their mind works and how you can speak uh, positivity into existence. And there's nothing more fulfilling than giving people knowledge or new knowledge and, and seeing them understand it. Uh, the, the idea of conversation, or me speaking to a big crowd is just a huge conversation. So if it's two people, then they're creating a third consciousness from what one person knows and the other person knows. So the bigger the crowd, the more information that's being transferred. And that's just awesome, all its own. For me, edutainment is the name of the game. I believe that you must entertain and educate at the same time.